Hey guys, I'm here with the, the 94M5 and I'm working on some of the black exterior trim. And I really want to share with you guys how much success I've had um, or how much I like using the, the 303 Aerospace. Okay, I had this sent to me. I got it on Amazon. I know you can get it all over the place. Um, but I've used other stuff before. I've used Back to Black. Um, I've used stuff that has foam applicators. Um, I've, I was looking at videos on YouTube. I looked at this one video that had a million a million views and these guys were selling stuff where you had to, it was for, um, you know, uh, door handles and stuff like that, any kind of black plastic trim, um, where you, and they had to, you had to mask off the trim and then use some kind of solvent to clean the area and then use this um, foam applicator to put dye all over your plastic. And it seemed really, really ridiculous when you could use this, when you could use this product, which has tons of other uses, and take care of all of your black trim. So on the E34, E32, E36, um, all these older BMWs, when the when the trim gets gray and faded, it really dates the car. Um, but you can take this, and it's very simple. Um, all you do is spray it on a microfiber cloth, wipe it on, then buff it off, um, and it makes a huge difference. So this is the passenger side, um, passenger side plastic on the um, side view mirror so this is a 94 right and this car is 20 well, 24 years old almost uh years old and this is what this side looks like now it's not you know, it's not greasy it's not you're not you're not painting it you're, you're you're applying the stuff that really seems to be soaked up by the plastic and then buffed off and so i did this the other day that's how it looks i haven't touched it in in three days and then i want to go over and show you how it was before, and this is the state that the plastic was in. So I, I touched this part. This is one swipe with a microfiber towel that had the uh, aerospace protected on it. And then you can see this is what everything else looked like. Okay, so this is what that driver's side mirror looked like. Same, same here, you can see it's real gray and, and disgusting. You can see right there where I stopped. Okay, so I'm gonna come back and do an, another application or two um, on this thing and make it look brand new like the driver's side is uh, looking right now we've got the impact trim also um, dates the car a whole lot when the stuff is gray so I did one application on this side and then one application on the front and you can see I left like a five inch gap right there that I have not touched um, again you're I'm probably gonna do a couple more applications um, just to make it look even better but that's a that's a pretty big difference I mean you can imagine how much that dates the car when the paint looks pretty good and you have trim that's uh, just pretty gray and disgusting like that. I know I've already done the door handles. Um, I did two applications in the door handles. It made a huge difference. I'm really kind of bummed that I didn't take up the four pictures because I was really surprised at how well that came out with two, two or three applications. And again, when I'm saying an application, I mean putting it on a microfiber towel, wiping it on, then buffing it off with another dry microfiber towel. Um, really, really easy. And then before I finish off, I'll show you guys the filler plate. So, again, very old, very old filler plate. I did this this morning. It took about um, five minutes. Five minutes of wiping it on and then buffing it off. It's not greasy. Um, it looks, it looks new. It looks like um, if you were to order one from Abrams Motorsport or, or whatever, that that's how it would look. And this is what it looked like this morning. So I'm really excited to go and and get this cleaned up make it look like that um, so I thought I'd share that with you guys I really I really recommend using this I really enjoy it um, and it's a real cheap way to bring a lot of life back to the car